I think this is a coming home for a lot of our folks who passed away over there in Vietnam. 58,281 souls who uh, made the ultimate sacrifice in theater, uh, of whom 4,119 are New York State and uh, 1,744 from New York City. And so for us, it's a good opportunity to just welcome them back and to show them that we love them and to tell the story of their sacrifice. The Vietnam veterans in our midst I didn't get a homecoming parade. They didn't get their community to stop and welcome them home. And this is that homecoming parade. We just brought them home. It's going to rest here. It's going to sit, set up here and it'll be here for a few days. People can come see the wall, honor their uh, friends or people they serve with. And uh, even if you didn't serve with them, at least you know what it means and we can keep it going with the, uh, you know, the wall, the meaning of the Vietnam Memorial. A lot of people don't know. This means a whole lot to me because I've served in the military, you know, and I, uh, I've watched all the guys' faces and uh, I see the joy that they get from talking about this project. So it, uh, you know, I feel that too. You know, the magic of seeing Tim hook up on Sunday, he goes to slide in there to hook up and he goes, now what am I pulling? And he sees it and he was, the look on his face and how he reflected back, those are those magical people to then make it and for a company to take their time to say we're going to send our driver we're going to send our equipment we're going to take him away from earning revenue for us to make this happen because we know it means something to him and we know it means something to us as a company we can't say thank you enough prime is one of the best when it comes to that and we're happy to have them as partners